the discovery of an enormous tomb in northern Greece, dating to the time of Alexander the Great of Macedonia, has enthused Greeks, distracting them from a dire economic crisis. Who, they are asking, is buried within? In early August, a team of Greek archaeologists led by Katerina Peristeri unearthed what officials say is the largest burial site ever to be discovered in the country. The mound is in ancient Amphipolis, a major city of the Macedonian Kingdom, 100 kilometers, 62 miles, east of Thessaloniki, Greece's second city. The structure dates back to the late 4th century BC and the wall surrounding it is 500 meters, 1,600 feet, in circumference, dwarfing the burial site of Alexander's father, Philip II, in Virginia, west of Thessaloniki. We are watching in awe and with deep emotion the excavation in Amphipolis, Greek culture minister Konstantinos Tisoulis told the BBC. This is a burial monument of unique dimensions and impressive artistic mastery. The most beautiful secrets are hidden right underneath our feet. Inside the tomb, archaeologists discovered two magnificent caryatids. Each of the sculpted female figures has one arm outstretched presumably to discourage intruders from entering the tomb's main chamber. The Caryatid's modern counterparts are sitting in a police car, some 200 meters, 650 feet, from the tomb's entrance. The dig site is protected 24 hours a day by two police officers. Their mission is to keep away the scores of journalists and tourists who arrive here by a winding dirt road from the nearby village of Mesoakia. An imposing no-entry traffic